Weather Authority forecast. It's a beautiful start to your Friday morning. A live look at the Tulsa today. Thanks to our roof spy, Nico Sky Tracker. If you take a quick look and a closer look, you can see birds flying as the sun has officially risen. Hints of pinks and purples and even some light oranges. And as that sun rises, so those temperatures, so those winds at times as a change of the weather pattern will be in store after the heat for the next couple of days. Now, we did see some storms previously in the western part of our viewing area. Now, high pressure system has moved on in, clearer skies for much of Texas, but still that plume of moisture in southeast New Mexico, that's that monsoon flow. Isolated strong storms there, but has since tracked off way to the west, west of our viewing area, clearer and drier conditions with southerly winds taking hold and as a result those temperatures are going to skyrocket this afternoon. Current temperature 77 degrees in Tulsa. I think it'll dip to 75 degrees warming up to 101 degrees compared to normal will be about five degrees above normal in many locations for this afternoon. So yeah, a very hot day in store after it's starting off pretty mild for this morning. Current temperature 61 degrees in Marfa. These initial conditions in this model a little bit off, but generally pretty representative of what we're seeing this morning. And then we're going to be seeing again a lot of pinks and reds on this temperature map because of the heat this afternoon. So make sure you guys hydrate later today. Temperatures close to 105 degrees in the Trans Pecos and also the Rio Grande, mid to upper 90s elsewhere across the region. Cooling off tonight in the 60s and 70s, similar to what we're seeing right now in fairly pleasant weather conditions because of the clear skies, those fairly light winds, low temperature, 75 degrees, those winds out of the south at 10 to 15 miles per hour. Checking any chances of rain non existent this morning. However, there will be a few storms firing off in the western part of our viewing area in the Van Horn Mountains near Carlsbad, mostly in rural areas just like we saw yesterday, so really not affecting too much of you guys. And as we head to overnight, any storms dissipating with mostly clear skies, few afternoon clouds tomorrow, but generally still mostly sunny and still hot out there. Now, again, we need the rainfall. We're likely not to see it in the latest drought update. These darker reds indicate exceptional drought in the Trans Pecos, the Rio Grande, Brewster County, extreme drought in those lighter reds in the Midland and Odessa area. And we need the rainfall. And that's something that we may see later this weekend, but still hot, mostly sunny and dry tomorrow at 100 degrees, 94 degrees on Sunday with more windy conditions, really mixing the air around and providing a change in the weather pattern. That change in the weather pattern will be stormier weather potentially Sunday, Monday and Tuesday after the hot, sunny and dry conditions that we'll be seeing today and tomorrow.